Welcome back. It was a horrendous crime, a father shooting his own son, then turning the gun on himself. Now the mother of this boy is testifying the state capitol, so she says children can grow up safe. Our Brian Malahi live at the capitol. Uh, Brian, many people remember when this uh, census tragedy happened. It was terrible. It was terrible. I was working last May, the day that Salt Lake police revealed that two people had been found dead inside a Sugar House area office building. 16-year-old Om Moses Gandhi had been shot by his father, according to police. This after a custody dispute. Today, Ohm's mother, Leah Moses, was at the Capitol testifying for HB 272, which requires in custody cases that courts consider not only physical, but psychological safety of kids. What would this bill have done, if anything, to protect your son? No piece of paper and no statute is going to stop an abuser. I mean, that's, that's just the reality of things. But I, I truly believe that if it had been in place and if it had been used and really put into motion, then he would be here with us today. I think he'd be able to testify, actually. The measure supported by Leah Moses passed unanimously in a committee on its first test here at the Capitol. That bill also directs the courts to have training, presumably for judges, to recognize domestic violence, children's safety, physical and psychological, and to recognize coercive control. Live at the Capitol, Brian Malahi, KUTV 2 News.